question. Do you know what uh, happened to you? I was having dinner. Uh huh. And I just couldn't. And you couldn't move? No, I couldn't chew. Okay, can you do me a favor and lift up your hands, please? Please? Uh oh, that's not good. Okay, smile again for me. All right, registration, do we have the chart? Okay. And it's already time. Please step to CAT scan. Right here. I'm going to take you from the stretcher and put you on it to another one. Hi, Dr. Bell, Hi. can you see the patient? I can see the patient well. Oliver, I want you to follow Angela's finger to the right. Open your eyes wide, please. Keep your head still. Eyes good. Okay, other side, please, and hold it there for a moment. Can you open your eyes wide? I can't see very well. How about the left eye? Can't see that one. Good. So the odds are that he's going to do better with the medicine than without the medicine. If we do nothing, there's a very good chance that Oliver will not have any change and he'll be left with left-sided paralysis. of auto place going in. Dr. Belt, we're going to hook up the IV. Great. Listen, from the time he came in until the time he got the bolus, it was 21 minutes. That's incredible time, everybody. Real good job. I've been in practice for 28 years, and telestroke technology, I've only been exposed to for the past two years that I've been here at Overlook. But prior to that, in my private practice, I would get a call from the emergency room during a busy office day. I would assess the patient by phone and speaking to the emergency room, I would never see the patient. And then either once I stabilize patients in the office, maybe within the next 30 to 60 minutes or at the end of the day, all doctors to the ER. I would go into the emergency room and see the case. Usually though, they were seeing me after they'd already received the TPA. Uh, and the fact is there are a lot of patients that don't have strokes that were receiving TPA. So it's good to have a stroke neurologist see the case immediately. What Telestroke has done, it's allowed me to be able to break for a few minutes, do a Telestroke here in the office, make sure the patient truly has a stroke, give the right care, then go through the rest of my office and then assess the patient later.